Well, from the historical point of view, Germany is, a, uh, as everyone knows, a, a federal state. And the development of this federal state and the stability of Germany is predominantly uh, caused by the Mittelstand uh, companies who are uh, providing the, the stability of the areas. So um, if you see the top five or top seven cities that um, are very looked upon and very uh, searched after for or where investments are uh, being made at the moment or investors look at. Um, there are some, some other areas, these prosperous regional areas that show a very, uh, very high yield in comparison to, to the uh, top seven. And they have a stability which is similar to, to the uh, top seven. As these local um, companies that are stable staying in their, uh, in their home city and really bringing up the country or bringing up the city to a, uh, economic development. Um, and from, from that perspective, if you, if you have the right um, look upon these, uh, these, these uh, smaller cities, um, you can make a very good uh, return with a, with a low risk profile. And, um, so, but you have to take into account one, on one side the location and some other um, factors which are um, interesting to, to look at to have the right choice. And on the other side, you do also need to have somebody with an, with an idea on the ground what is the development of the country, uh, of, the, of the city, and also on the, on the real estate itself. So on one side, yes, uh, looking at some regional prosperous areas is very interesting, but you do have to have local knowledge then, and you should have somebody who is locally connected uh, to guide you for cross-border transactions in these areas.